Hey, what is up everyone? It is Dimension here, back at it with some more Vagabond readings. We're on chapter 216. We're basically where Denshichiro and Musashi are about to fight, and uh, I've been waiting for it, man. I can't wait to see exactly how it's gonna go down. It's been a year now, and Musashi has changed so much. He is literally so strong, and uh, he's literally so, so much more powerful than Denshichiro, especially with the way he destroyed, you know, Seijuro. So, um, I'm, I'm not really sure what to expect from this fight. I think uh, Denshichiro will, will die, and uh, it will be at the hands of Musashi. So so anyways, let's just continue on and uh, let's read some Vagabond. You're saying you'll give me more time for me to... Time passes the same for everyone, even for me. Oh, I think this is a flashback, right? Back to Takazo. Like, at their first encounter. Look how bloody he was, man. Holy shit. He, he, uh, he could not take on Denjichiro back then. One year. Time refines and time betrays. Holy shit, look at this. What beautiful art, man. I love this. The same year. A mere year. I see you now as though I were looking at you from a distant past. Denshichiro. Look at that stare, man. Musashi. Honestly, Musashi is definitely one of the best protagonists out there. How the fuck do you become so strong in, 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 in the time frame of a year? Like, that's insane. Like, these, these men that he's killing are literal samurai masters, man. They are, they are the head of their clan. And it's amazing that Musashi took out the Yoshioka head and holy fuck, man. I can no longer understand you. Looking back, I was just a crude hick one year ago. You still are. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Grandma uh, Hanadin. <laughs> uh, I feared nothing. I had nothing to lose. Yet, I had my fighting spirits. The spirit to challenge a Yoshioka and a quick temper. And that toughened me up. Sharpened me up. You were able to step into that part of my life nicely, Denshichiro. And the result? Oh yeah, the gash on his chest. I lay restless for three days and three nights. It's been a year since then. You're half a step further away now compared to back then. You cannot kill me. Shall we call off this duel? Denshichiro. <laughs> oh no, Denshichiro's not gonna like that. Yeah, ha! Holy fuck. Why are you yelling like that? Is that how you should be swinging your sword? The way you stiffen your muscles, which moves your sword. Your sword isn't reaching you. Holy shit, just no fear out of Musashi, look at him. Like, back then, Musashi would be the one to act like a fool and scream and, and be so brute, but look at him here, so calm, and his strikes don't even phase him. He knows he's stronger than Denshichiro. So you will never reach me. He missed. That's twice he's missed with his strike. Denshichiro's pressuring him. Why do you wield a sword? So it can take shape and become more? More of a sword to show off your swordsmanship. And then here's Otsu and Jotaro. Holy fuck, I forgot they're in the crowd. He can't hear it. Did he get him? No. Close. Ha. <sighs> I must keep this distance. Just enough distance so that he can't touch me. My fight is there. Ah, I see. It's really coming down. Oh, the snow, yeah. Does it snow this much every year in the capital? Can't you hear it, Denshichiro? So beautiful. I love the way he's speaking to him. The voice of your sword. Wait, just wait. If you would just use me properly, there would be nothing to stand in our way. I'm sorry. Holy fuck, man. He broke his sword. Poor Denshichiro, man. He, he, it, it's sad to say, but he never stood a chance. Why don't I end it? Stop, stop right there. You can do it. You're pressuring him. It's fine to run away. If you don't want to fight the duel. A sword is just a sharp tool solely for killing. A sword cannot stop other swords. Oh my god, look at the aura around this man. Oh, and Denshichiro takes another breath. You can do this. He's trying to calm himself. I had only planned to win this fight and live on, but it seems I can't hope for as much. Oh man, his family. I've thrown away my chance to live on. Oh man. Truly a family man. I, I, I have so much respect for Denshichiro, honestly. Great opponent. You know, most of the opponents in Vagabond are just great. A final wish. Forward, Denshichiro, 217. I've given up that future. He can do it. Denshichiro's on the offensive. Musashi doesn't seem as lively today. Do you really think so? I, for one, cannot see that. It's embarrassing to admit, but I can't stop trembling. All I can do now is believe. That was, that was what I decided to do. I believe. I have nothing left but to believe in Master Denshichiro. Forward, into his range. I came here to win, but Musashi... I feel that won't be enough. Oh man, he's shaking. It's so painful. I was born into a family of the sword, so I studied and studied and got a little conceited where I'd struggled, struggled to in my ability. I've bragged about my current abilities, which I attained through much study, but because of that, I know one thing, Musashi. 
You've gone so far ahead. And that difference between us hasn't shrunk a bit. Oh my god, I'm getting little goosebumps. Fuck. Ah. <sighs> and he's just breathing. Forward. I've thrown it all away. Winning. Even my future. I am only here now for one reason. And it isn't to win. Musashi. I am only here to end your life, you bastard. That's all my life is for. <laughs> How stupid. Oh. Who's that sitting next to him? But that is just like you. Is this his dad? I'm always watch- Oh my god. I'm always watching over you, Denshi Chiro. <sighs> Forward. Only a little more until I'm within range. Forward. He's in. I am the son of Yoshioka Kenpo. Yoshioka Denshichiro. I used to give my father's name in order to make myself look stronger. But today, I am fighting to protect that name. Guys, I'm, I'm just feeling goosebumps. Oh, holy fuck. Forward. Oh, his family. Jesus, dude. Like, guys, holy fuck, man. Jeez. Like, Musashi is so fast. I wonder what Denshichiro's thinking right now, losing his arm. He still has a blade in his hand, maybe he might strike again. Otsu didn't watch from the beginning to the end. Denshichiro's uh, heroism. 218 death. <sighs> Damn. It's almost like Denshichiro's hugging him, dude. I have you now. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. He's gonna hold him and then use the other sword to kill. Holy fuck. Is Musashi's eyes closed? Are they open? What the fuck? Can't even see his eyelids. I don't know if they're either closed or his eyes are just blank. Oh my god. That was literally the only way he could get close to Musashi. He had to hold him in place. But holy fuck, he's lost so much blood. Everyone's lucky. And even Taquan, holy shit. Are those, are those his guts? What? Wait, wait, wait. Den. Oh, the blade's in him. Dude, look at Musashi's expression. Holy fuck. Oh dear me. Musashi. You've done well. You've done well to come this far in a year. I'm glad you were my final opponent. What's with you? Hurry up and fall over, Denshichiro. Was it not me who just won? <sighs> Damn, he couldn't even get it striking. Father. Oh man, his arm still, oh my god, the blade is still in his fucking body. Oh my god. Denshichiro, that's just like you. Oh man. And then Granny Honadin's like, bah, Jesus, dude, show some respect. Out of the way, let me through. Make, a, make way for the elderly. Jesus, Musashi. Is he thinking about Otsu? Or did he like notice her? Master's going to leave. Why won't you go to him, Otsu? I'm fine. What? Again? I'm fine right here. Oh, and the men gather around. Now they're gonna hunt down Musashi. I found it on our altar this morning. Ueda Ryohei, the aforementioned, is hereby expelled. However, this only lasts for as long as the household master Yoshioka Denshichiro is alive. Oh, fuck. A never-ending struggle. Inseparable relations, 219. Expelled, however. This only lasts for as long as the household master Yoshioka Denshichiro is alive. If something were to happen to the master, the aforementioned would not return as a mere student, but as the master himself, devoting himself entirely to the household for as long as he should live. Den. Yo, big, big respect to Denshi Chiro, I'm not gonna lie. Definitely one of my favorite characters from this story, and the way he went out, man, it's so sad. But he died honorably, honestly. A man always to his word, and uh, nothing but respect for him. So he drew his wakizashi, then split open Denshi Chiro's stomach. That's what it was. That's why there was a blade in him. He used the short sword. I, I, I didn't know if, if, if he actually used two swords or he left his own sword in, implanted in him. But uh, I guess he used, the, he used the wakizashi, like he said. Okay, makes sense. He was able to make such a movement in that instant. How flexible and unfettered. Musashi has gone that far. Yeah, uh, he literally has to draw it out too. And, and he already was holding his, his own sword. Like, holy fuck, man. And everyone's wrapping up. Oh, dude, they're all crying. Master Denshi Chiro. Ah! Oh, dude. And they're all crying. They wrap up his arm. Yoichi. Hey, here. Here, give this to your wife. What? What is that? It's my little brother. My, my little brother. It's moving. Oh, it's a snake. Oh, it's a Neil. It'll make her live longer. She's going to be giving birth soon, right? Birth to your child. 
He's great. <laughs> Dude, Denshichiro was such a great guy, honestly. Holy fuck, man. Oh, hey, look. That's the Yoshioka. Then that's Denshichiro. Musashi won. Musashi really won. You can't be serious. Oh, man, he's still dripping blood, man. Holy fuck. I never thought there'd be a man who could beat both Seijuro and Denshichiro one right after the other. That's just life. The Yoshioka are finished now. Musashi, you will not be forgiven. Yep, all the men are ready. And they're reading the his banished letter, yeah. No objections. We c He can't have gone very far yet. Do not let Musashi out of Kyoto. Oh man, the, the last of the Yoshioka, man. Holy fuck. And Musashi by himself. Oh my god. Musashi. I'd like to ask you a question. Approaching footsteps. Chapter 220. Honor and hatred. Beautiful. Again, the, the, the backgrounds, man. So beautiful. Musashi. I'd like to ask you a question. I am one of the ten swords. Kobashi Kurando. Hmm. Oh, and there's more men. The wakizashi that sliced Denshichiro's belly was his own. Oh. So it wasn't even Musashi's uh, wakizashi. Holy shit. Did you foresee that would happen and prepare for it? Or was it just a reflex? Well, my first stroke was fairly shallow. I was also being slightly pressured. If I felt that it would not be sufficient against Denshichiro as he was then. Yeah, that's what I felt. I don't remember much afterwards. Oh, he kind of like blinked out. Yeah, there, there's something There's something when, when Musashi is attacking, especially like a uh, couple chapters back when he attacked uh, Seijuro, he kind of blinked out. Like all his senses heightened and his mere focus was killing him and he killed him in an instant. But I don't remember like seeing the blade actually go through him. It was just an, it was literally just in an instant. It was just a reflex. I admire your skill, Musashi. Read this. We will face each other only once more. A request. Why? Isn't this enough? Why? Though selfish, we can no longer go back to, to what we once were. The Yoshioka household cannot continue without you, Musashi. Oh, shit. Ichi, uh, Joji, I think? Hopefully I'm not butchering that. At the Drooping Pine. We, the Yoshioka, are now inseparably bound to you, Musashi. Yoshioka Dojo Head. Ueda Ryohei. Oh, damn, Ueda took the head. With respect and hatred. Look at his eyes. Holy shit. Fuck, it's about to be a face-off, man. <gasps> oh, he starts writing. Was I not the victor? Of course I was. Ah, Denshichiro. Shall I bring you some ink to write with, sir? I'm fine. Huh? Oh, yeah, him with the water. <laughs> Is that Otsu? Did he draw Otsu? Huh? That's what he was drawing? He really loves her, man. It's already decided. The spiral of death and killing. Oh, man, Baikin. I will follow it. I will follow it as far as it will go. Sasaki Kojiro, formerly Hanadin Marahachi, he once walked into our dojo and challenged the Yoshioka. His head was swollen with pride, so we broke one of his arms and one of his legs, then threw him into the Kamogawa River. Holy fuck, man. He's probably caught in a dam somewhere now. Hehehe. <laughs> Is that all? Huh? Er. We also cut off the thumb of his left hand. He will never swing a sword again. And do we know anything of Kojiro's whereabouts? Well, we believe he is holed up in a castle somewhere, that's all. We have no idea as to where he may be. Hmm, I think Ueda wants to still get his help in, in this fight. Phew. Master Ueda's gotten pretty intense since he became the household master. No, he has always had that. He's, he's always been standing one step behind the brothers until now. What should we do if the lie gets out? That we let Marahachi slip through our fingers? Not even our, our thumbs will be enough of an apology. Oh, Marahachi's back? What the? Sake, give me a warm one. I have to find Kojiro. Have you heard Musashi killed Denshichiro? Of course I've heard. So now he's beating Seijuro and Denshichiro, one right after the other. Miyamoto Musashi. I never knew such a man could exist. He's from my village. He's my friend. Oh my god, he's talking again. What the fuck? <laughs> Huh. Hey, have you seen a weird-looking samurai around here? He's got weird bangs hanging down like this. Have you? What's wrong, man? You haven't paid your bill. Damn, yeah, Monachi's really beat up. Kojiro. Where are you, Kojiro? Together we are one. I finally found a way of life. I felt like I'd finally found a way to fix my life. I will become your ears, your mouth. Let me help you, Kojiro. Together. Musashi. He's walking towards Musashi. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god. Instead of finding Kojiro, he finds Musashi. But I wonder if Musashi's gonna recognize him because he's all beat up and he's got the new hair. Overlapping memories. 221, an old friend. I thought so. Marahachi. He's actually glad to see him. Oh, and then Marahachi just turns away and runs. What the fuck is he doing? The first time that Musashi actually recognizes him, he runs. What the fuck? Huh? Hey, Marahachi. Hey, he's zooming. 
He thinks he can get away from me on foot. <laughs> oh, he starts sprinting too. Oh, he's so much faster than him. <laughs> Look at him. He caught up to him in an instant. Oh, Malahachi, you're not escaping. Now he's panting. The reason I'm, I'm breathing so hard is because I was just drinking. Ha ha ha. I see. I don't ask. I didn't ask about that. What's with your face? It's nothing. Just your everyday fight. But it was three against one. I had two swords at my waist. Just screaming out how manly I am. And well, it just happens. That happens to you too, doesn't it? Hmm, well, yeah, probably. Fights and stuff. Yeah, probably. You, the demon of the sword? Don't you know that every man in the world just wants to be as strong as you? Sake, bring me sake, two bottles. Don't worry, this time it'll be a relaxing drink. I laughed so hard back then. Your face was just priceless, Takazo. It was you. Your face was like this. <laughs> he has like food in his mouth. <laughs> Liar. Don't make me laugh. <laughs> it makes my mouth hurt. <laughs> Your granny's just as healthy as ever. Hmm? You've seen her? She's here in the capital. You aren't with her? Check the inns. You'll find her. Yeah. Anyway, drink, Takizo. Well, I can't drink anymore. I can't hold my liquor uh, anymore. Less so than usual. <laughs> yeah, sure. He doesn't take liquor. <laughs> How many years has it been? It feels just like yesterday. Oh, Dude, poor Madachi. I actually feel bad for him. I heard there's a huge war starting up. Let's go, Takazo. I feel I'll regret I'll regret it my whole life if I let this one slip past me. Takazo, let's leave this village. Oh, dude. Let's become famous. He puts the cup down. Oh, he's crying. Heh. <laughs> but man, were we naive? Yeah, we were. I was so goddamn serious about going all out. I'm surprised I'm still alive. But nowadays, you're amazing, Takazo. Or should I say Musashi? Mr. Miyamoto Musashi. Don't. That just feels wrong. <laughs> Uh, just call me Takazo. <laughs> what are you saying? There hasn't been a day I haven't heard your name here. The day I arrived in the capital. All the people working in the streets looked so clean and refined. Uh, it was amazing. I felt so damn insignificant. I was so nervous living here. I never thought this day would come. I wouldn't have believed that the Miyamoto Musashi, who defeated the ce celebrated Yoshioka brothers, one right after the other, would be the Takazo that I grew up with as if, my as if he were my own brother. How great. Just so great. Good work, Takazo. Ha 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 ha. Gulp. Phew, haven't you had enough? Are you alright? I couldn't drink that much. <laughs> Wasn't it one year ago that you barely escaped from the Yoshioka Dojo with your life? Oh, how do you know that? I was the one who took you all bloodied up to that sake shop. And after that, I took you to Shishido Baikin's place. No, that doesn't matter anymore. You didn't say anything back then, but you really did become famous. You finally made it, Takazo. Aw, oh, dude, poor, poor Madahachi. I mean, the thing with Madahachi is I, I feel bad for him. He never got to really achieve anything like Musashi did. Musashi actually, you know, stuck to himself and became disciplined and learned from everything that he did. Madahachi is kind of like this person who never changes. And, you know, they just stay the same throughout their life. And um, they're just complete opposites. It, it, it's amazing that these two were so close. But yet now they, they, they're, they are so far apart. Musashi will come down this road tomorrow. What a lonely place. The Yoshioka will not change, even if the household heads are killed one after another. We will not yield. We will not falter. This is what we will show the world. We will kill Musashi with all 70 of our men at once. S 70 Huh? Right somewhere around the Great Sanjo Bridge will do fine. Oh my god, and Musashi's in the trees. We will kill Musashi and show off his corpse. How is he gonna kill 70 fucking samurai? Uh-huh? Chapter 222, Friends. What you can't go back to. It's a lonely place, even during the day. There won't be any people passing by here at dawn. No matter what we what we do uh, to slay Musashi, there will be no one here to see it. We will kill Musashi with all 70 of our men at once. We will show off his corpse to the world. Who shall we say killed him? It doesn't matter who. He slew the brothers one after the other. So one of the Yoshioka rose and exacted, re uh, and exacted re uh, vengeance upon him. The Yoshioka dojo will be whole. Then we will tell the whole world that Ueda Ryohei is a new... As a new household head. Wait a minute. We have to uphold our reputation by living by the sword. Yet we're supposed to kill one man with the whole of the Yoshioka? Horikawa. Whether it is right or not. Whether it is cowardly or not. Or anything of that nature. Ponder it as much as you like after we have slain him. Yoichi. Higashi. Tagaya. Uh, fu Fuji... Ui? Fuji... I don't know how to say that. Kurando. Give up on comparing your techniques with the Musashi when you fight. Slay him from behind. Damn, he wants him to fight dirty. He's like, fuck the honor code, fuck all that. Kill this man and gang up on him. Holy shit. And Musashi's literally listening to all this. I mean, realistically, if you were in Musashi's position, listening to these men tell, tell, tell each other how they're going to kill you, 
without any mercy, no, no honor. I would be fucking shitting myself. 70 men? Man, Musashi's got some balls, dude. Did I really talk to Takuzo last night? Could it have been a dream? But you really did become famous. You finally made it, Takuzo. Why am I crying? Huh? Why don't- Why? Don't say a thing. Don't. Oh yeah, back then. I should apologize for that now. Now I can finally. No. No, I haven't. I haven't made it anywhere yet. There's too much I still don't know. I love Musashi. There's always something, you know, further ahead. I love that. You're gonna keep on going? You're really gonna keep on going, Takuzo? Wait. Hey. Wait, man. Hey. Wait, I said. Takuzo. Enough about me. What have you been doing since then? If I had to guess, by, If I had to guess by how you look, you've been quite... Leave me be. Huh? I don't really matter to you, right? You haven't s made it, you say. He's overflowing his cup. Stop putting on airs. Jesus, dude. He threw the cup at him. And Musashi was quick, too. He dodged that. Oh, my God. Monahachi, relax, dude. You never had a teacher or a school. You've only got your backwater sword style, the one you learned from running around that mountain. Yeah, same with you. <laughs> Occasionally. Not very often. You should say that you've done way too much. Uh, you've done way too much having gotten this far. You know who Sasaki Kojiro is? I tell you. You can't even reach up to the bottoms of his feet. Oh, he remembers. Ganryu, Sasaki Kojiro, and Kuujiro. Haha, <laughs> you turn yellow just looking at him. <laughs> he grips his cheek. Yeah, he was an interesting guy. You know him? Murahachi's like, what? Yeah, I talked with him a little while ago. <laughs> Don't lie. I can see right through that lie too easily. He can't freaking talk. Oh yeah, now that you mention it. That's weird. I felt like I talked to him. That's interesting. Y you asked what I'm doing these days, right? I'll tell you. I'm Sasaki. Hey, could you two leave? You're causing trouble for the other customers. I can't have you breaking any more of our bowls. What? <laughs> Leave. You don't even need to pay the bill. You drank too much, Matahachi. Look at you staggering around. Shut up. I'm not drunk. As if I get drunk with only that little bit. Don't think I'm weak like you. Hey, where's Otsu? Huh? Where's Otsu? Where's my fiance? She and Musashi left the village together. So the two of them, er, have already had relations? Stupid child. Just how old do you think those two are? She's with you, I know it. I know everything. <laughs> you may be famous now, but aren't you supposed to be training? You must think highly of yourself to bring a woman with you while you train. A bit confused. How was she with you? She really lets out a sweet scream. Oh, shit. And then Matahachi is uh, cleaning his eye or putting a rag on it. I... I lost a friend. Oh no, did he punch him? Yeah, I was about to say, you do not just say that about Otsu, dude. She really lets out a sweet scream. Do not say that, especially in front of Musashi. Oh, he has two black eyes now. <laughs> I mean, he gets what he deserves, honestly. That's... You don't say that type of shit. Come on. If you know they had a relationship, you don't be a dickhead and say dumb shit like that. Come on. Chapter 223, Musings in a Tree. Uh, unconcealed murderous intent. What? Human bones. This place... Has this place been a battlefield before? Don't pick that up. Hey, <laughs> hey. That could be someone Master Kenpo slew. What? Master Kenpo? I have my personal reasons for choosing this place as well. The truth is, I first met Master Kenpo here. Right here. Oh, Musashi's on the tree. So the whole of the Yoshioka are going to come after me. All 70 of them. Well, the spiral of death and killing ends here. I'm going to die. This time. Without a doubt. Yeah. H how? Like, don't get me wrong. Musashi is strong, but to fight 70 men, I don't, I don't see any, like, normal samurai taking on 70 fucking men. But... This is Musashi, you know. He's surprised me before. If he fucking actually kills all of them, um, I don't know, man. He, he's already goaded, so he might just kill them all. I don't know. Though I thought this was over after I killed the two brothers. But if they were to acknowledge that, then no one would join their dojo, I guess. Like I care. One, two, three. Seventy of them. Ten times what they have now. It's impossible. Two days. Wait, no two ways about it. And they plan to show off my corpse on the Great Sanjo Bridge. Shit. And then <laughs> Gran Granny uh, Hanadin, that whole Hanadin hag, will be the most pleased about the whole thing. Death. Death. I wanted to do that after I fixed all these misunderstandings. I didn't force Marahachi to leave the village. The old hag shouldn't feel that bitter about it. It doesn't matter, as long as I know the truth. I know it. I know everything. Where is Otsu? Where did he get that from? Speaking of misunderstandings, Marahachi, you weren't looking at me last night. You were looking at... The me you created in the few years we hadn't seen each other. She gets pretty loud, doesn't she? How was she with you? The me in your mind. The story in your mind. That story reflects your own self. Your true self. It reflects you as you are now. 
he cries a little bit and you know he's saying some real stuff i i, I really really love the the saying you know especially saying those rude things to Ma to musashi just because you've heard some things like the way you project yourself onto others definitely says a lot about you and i really love what musashi was saying here you know the me in your mind the story in your mind that's that's a story that reflects your own self your true self and it's true that is so true madahachi had this you know this image of of old takazo you know not not the man that not the man that musashi is today so he doesn't understand and um it's sad it's really sad so some real shit honestly some real shit musashi's quiet Oh, he almost tips over. Oh, he's hanging like a koala. Oh, he gets back up. Otsu, how did I look to you? In my eyes, you were exactly the same. Such a disappointment. Otsu, you are always within me. And that, that is probably the Otsu that I created. Ah, uh, his image of her. Guys, see, th this stuff, is it, it speaks to the heart. This stuff is so beautiful. I'm alone. Always have been. Oh, yeah, he has the... Probably has a little bruise from punching Madahachi. You idiot, Madahachi. I should have punched you a lot harder. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. Oh, is he falling down now? Oh, what an entrance. Are you kidding me, dude? He's gonna take on these men now? Oh, shit. Look at them all look back. <gasps> hmm. Moo. And they're like, what the fuck? Musashi. Oh, Yoichi comes straight through. Yoichi, wait. <laughs> he gets a rock. He literally just threw that freaking rock at like supersonic speed. Oh my god. Musashi has a thing for going for the eyes, man. Like, <laughs> I don't blame him though. He needs every advantage he can get because these dudes are not going to play fair. Musashi, know that it would have been better for you to stay lurking in that tree. Or are you confident that you can take us all on? <laughs> well, this is better than crossing blades with 70 of you. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, guys. Oh, uh, what the fuck is Musashi gonna do, man? I mean, against 10 of them, you know, it's still a lot of- The the odds are against him, but 10 of them is much more manageable than fucking 70. So let's see. Earth that cries out for blood. The drooping pine of Ichijoji. This is better than crossing blades with 70 of you. Besides, it seems all of your masters are here. What should we do, Oida? Leave, of course. Our duel is tomorrow, after all. No change in plans. Yawn. He's just scratching himself. <laughs> Shall we do this here and now? Or not. We will. <laughs> Yo, Musashi's like, we're doing this now. Oh, Ueda approaches. Draw, Musashi. We will do this here. Which is it? Ueda, has something happened, Musashi? Your spirit is wavering. Huh? What happened to the man who wouldn't lift an eyebrow when calmly slaying someone? Your breathing is extremely shallow. He goes, shh. Holy shit. He zoomed at him. Oh, Ueda, you better relax, boy. Oh, actually, he's so quick. Holy fuck. Did, did the Musashi even have a chance to draw? He made it in. I, I don't know what happened. It, seem, it seems like... I thought Oeda already cut him. They're both breathing, looking at each other. Well, now, this must be the drooping pine of Ichijoji. I heard... Dude, look at their eyes. Holy fuck. I heard that I should use a drooping pine as a landmark to find my way to Konpuku Temple. Hmm. It seems as though I have intruded upon something. <laughs> Yo, where did Tak one come from? Holy shit. Well, he's gonna see Musashi duel all the Yoshioka now. Okay. Dude, look at Ueda. He is just focused on killing this man. Ueda seems very, very formidable as well. Until tomorrow, he goes away. And Musashi is going away too. This is regrettable. But no need to dwell on it. It will be tomorrow. Did I intrude upon something? If you don't meet a man for three days... Was it? You've changed much, but you still remind me a bit of the old Takazo, even today. You're bleeding. Oh, he did cut him. Holy shit. That's what I'm saying. Ueda was so quick. He really got Musashi off guard. He is quite the man, isn't he? You're planning on crossing blades with that. Well then, a cup for us meeting again. You're a priest and yet you're drinking sake. Nothing's changed. It's only a little bit. Who cares? It's good, too. <laughs> Oh, Takwan. So tomorrow is your final battle with the Yoshioka. I'm not going. Who the hell would go to a place where 70 men are lying in wait? I'm leaving the capital. Yeah, I don't I don't blame him, man. Fuck that. They're gonna they're they're playing so dirty. Fuck that. They will tell the public you're a coward, that you turned your back on your enemy and fled. They will say as much as they like. I don't particularly care what they think of me. Hmm, I see. I depart before the dawn. I'll say my farewells. Stay healthy, Takwan. Musashi, you've become kinder. You're getting stronger, I see. Yeah, because, I mean, Takuzo would not back down of a fight with 70 men. But look, Musashi's here saying, you know, forget it, man. 
it's not worth it. They can say whatever they want about me, but I know who I am. Yeah, dude, that the respect to Musashi, dude. Fuck them. <laughs> Fuck the Yoshioka. They they are just that's too much, man. Seventy men, get out of here. All truly strong people are kind. We both continue on our journeys. I pray that we can meet like this again someday. I really like that. I really love what he said here, man. All all truly strong people are kind. And it's kind of true. You know, the strongest characters we've met in this story, um, except for Ito. Ito was, was kind of crazy, okay? Ito was crazy. But uh, let's say like Ine and uh, Seki Shusai, they weren't really, you know... They weren't really crazy like like Ito, you know. They were very, I mean, especially in A, he was very he was very nice to to uh, Takazo, and he really you know guided him. So uh, yeah, that's that's some real stuff. Saying the truly stronger kind. Oh, and, and think of Kojiro too as as someone who's super nice but deadly. Yan, well then, is this the cro the road that will cross the mountain? Time to go. Ah, damn it! Seventy men by myself. How foolish could I be? All right, guys, I'm stopping here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Solid reading again. Uh, Musashi, definitely so strong. And uh, I still have a lot of respect for Dechichiro. He really tried to honor his name until his last breath. And uh, and uh, big respect to him, honestly. Deep down, Dechichiro knew he wasn't going to win. But he still did it anyway because he's an honorable man. Definitely one of my favorite characters. And it's sad to see him go, but... Not only was, you know, Musashi stronger than Denshichiro, he was stronger than his older brother, the one that was the best, the head of the Yoshioka. Honestly, it, it's kind of on them, you know, they knew, they knew they were cocky back then and they, you know, allowed him to become better. And of course, no one would expect, you know, this, this man Takuzo to become the man that he is today, so strong in just a year's time. So it is what it is, man. And uh, it's crazy that Ueda is leading the Yoshioka now and he didn't care about honor or anything. He just wanted to kill Musashi. So uh, he even landed a blow on him. I wonder if Kojiro will be joining soon because uh, they're definitely still looking for him. So I'm, I just don't want my duel between Musashi and Kojiro. So hopefully that does still happen. But regardless, guys, it was an awesome reading. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please do leave a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Comment down below if you have any other suggestions or just want to talk about some vagabond. Just leave it down below, guys. And as always, take care and peace.